What's up, everybody? It's your boy ENC here. And if you did, have not heard the news, heard the news already, um, the Eagles have traded Marcus Johnson, I think, or someone else, to the Seahawks, to the Seattle Seahawks, to for I mean for Michael Bennett and a seventh round pick, some or something. All right, and I'm gonna be straight up. If I think Michael Bennett is one of the biggest drama queens. In the NFL, that's what I think. Okay, and he's a defensive player. And most of the defensive players do aren't even crybabies. But still, this dude is basically full of it, man. It's like, it's like this dude has so many outside issues, outside the field with issues. Like I can't even count them all. Remember that that incident when he was altercation with the police officer saying I will the fucking hell one, and people say, oh, this is that's a, a typical. A uh, typical cop attacking a black guy. No, if you actually heard the story, actually heard the full story, it turns out he was resisting arrest because he was because when it was something in a building in Las Vegas, I think back in Las Vegas, um, the everybody in that building was told to sit down, no one move, no one move, and unlike him, he was run, he was still running. All right, and. Well, well, the police officers didn't have to do that. Well, if he was resisting arrest, yes, they did. I'm sorry to break the news to you, baby. That's what you do if you're a police officer. If that dude's resisting arrest, if he's disobeying what you're saying, then you're basically in your right. Something that you were told in the academy to do if that person does that stuff, okay? But, but still, man. Like I said, the dude's full of it, okay? That's where I think the dude's just full of it. But I've never said that the dude was, was a terrible defensive end. I think he's a great a defensive end, all right? I think he's good. Oh, and by the way, the Seahawks, I don't know what the heck they're doing. They're they're blowing up that defense, okay? They are blowing that shit up. I don't know what's going on, but they are just blowing it up. Oh, and by the way, some people need to remember this. What about Jimmy Graham, okay? Remember, Jimmy Graham's a free agent also, so we gotta, so we gotta pay attention to that. So yeah, and like I said, Michael Bennett is a great, great defensive, defensive end. Okay, I never said he was bad. All right, but at the same time, I and you know, let's just be honest. You know, Malcolm Jenkins got got involved in this because I'm pretty sure him and Michael Bennett are were friends. Of all this whole stupid ass protest shit, and yeah, like I said, man, stuff like that gets on my nerves. Ste keep fucking politics out of fucking sports. Fuck you, Colin Kaepernick. Like I said. You're a great quarterback, but you had to. But why did you have to put fucking sports in this fucking thing? Okay, I mean, I put, 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 put fucking politics in fucking sports. Okay, thanks a lot for that shit. All right, since you now nah, this shit may never go ahead, go away. But still, man. But still, uh, I don't know what the Eagles are doing as the for cap space. They're just, I'm, they're, after this trade, you already know Vinny Curry's gone. Like I said, they, these three motherfuckers should have traded him. Alright? They should have traded him, man. Like, we could have gotten something with him. Still, man, I don't know what the Eagles are going to do. Look, look. We're the best team in the NFL. So, we're not always going to have... So, we're basically have the only... Basically, the only good pick we have right now is... Oh, yeah, the 32 overall pick. Well, I'm pretty sure we're going to sign a linebacker. I don't just read that. And like I said, we can't resign LeGarrette Blunt, which I doubt we will. I, I, like I said, we don't resign Blunt, get Bo Scarborough. Okay? That's what I want. But, yeah, man. Um, Eagles. Um, I mean, this, like Big D just said, this just updated or upgraded our... O line, I mean D line, okay. Like this D line just got more dangerous, all right. And <sighs> man, I'm not sure what they're gonna do about Brandon Graham and Vinny. I mean, and Nigel Bradham. I already know they're gonna let go, let Patrick Robinson go. Patrick Robinson go. They're just gonna start Sidney Jones, which I have no problem with. That just makes more sense. But still, man, like I said, um. They did work thing. They, like I said, they should have extended some of these players during the regular season, like they did with Alshon Jeffrey and Timmy Jurgen. They should have uh, just, they should have just uh, expanded the contracts. It makes more sense. But yeah, man, good move by a uh, good move by the Eagles. I guess to get Michael Bennett. 
I'm sure I'm gonna have it. Now come, now come sue then Michael Bennett, alright? Okay, yeah, sure, you can say probably punks sue causes more drama, but I'd rather have him do some dirty plays than this dude outside problems, okay? But still, man, good move by the Eagles, I guess. I just don't know what else they're gonna make. They're probably gonna trade Nick Foles. I don't think they should. Because I'm not sure about Carson Wentz, though. I mean, I, like I said, they said his injury will last six to nine months. Probably is this for the next right? Six ring. Probably is this gonna be like a six month injury or something. But still, don't tr But still, I don't want him to rush anything, okay? I want him to be fully healthy around like week five or something. But still, man. Um, Eagles, I don't know what the hell you are gonna do next, but y'all better know what the fuck you're doing, alright? And if you are gonna make any more trades, uh, I can't be honest, I wish they would have gotten Richard Sherman instead, okay? I mean, I guess you can say he's more controversial as, more controversial than him, but still, he's a damn good cornerback. I would rather have him than Michael Bennett, okay? I'll be straight up. I'll be straight up. <laughs> How, this matter if we have Richard Sherman. Two people that probably hate, he, he'll be around two people, a fan base that hate one person one just as much as he does. Skip Bayless. He'll be met, he'll be met for Philly though. Let's be honest, he'll be met for Philly. But still, man, like I said, this is your boy ENC. See you later. Tell me what you think about this trade though. I'm not sure. I'm, like I said, I'm on off about it. Tell me what you think.